and this here is getting a full windshield tint and doing it in 40%. I've already got it on there, I did a rough cut of it and I've uh, started shrinking it a bit. I'm just going to shrink this side a little more and then I'm going to get to uh, cutting it precisely and then we'll start sticking it on the inside of the windshield. I'm going to do a reverse roll and then uh, go inside and unroll it. <laughs> that way it's a little cleaner job. Alright, so now I'm going to do a little better job of cutting. There's maybe a big wrinkle pop up when I hit him again. <laughs> and then, uh, we'll be so ready. See where my knife went? Alright, I think we're ready. Alright, so this side's looking pretty good. I'm gonna go over and shrink in a couple spots here, but overall it would probably go on good just like that. Well, that's that side done. We'll do the other side and it's ready to go on. Alright, so the memory card's pulling the camera and I can't seem to find any other ones. But this probably give you a better view anyways, the sound might not be as good. But um, I got it all heat shrunk, I'm going to get a light in the inside there, I got a new blade in my knife, and then I'm going to start cutting it out, get it all precisely cut, and then we'll be ready to stick it on.
All right, well, it's all cut. Now it's time, time to wash, roll up the tape, and we'll install. I'm washing this because there's plastic liner off on there that I'm going to pull off when I get inside and it's going to possibly drag across the windshield. I don't want to get getting any dirt on my nice clean windshield. Do my best to make sure it doesn't touch the windshield but just in case it doesn't hurt to have it clean. And after I do the other side of my going, I'm going to give it another wash just to make sure the big window. There we go. A lot of time put into doing this to have it not look good just because you didn't want to wash it again. Alright, so I got it all washed. I got the tank ready to go. I'm just gonna spray it down with the slip solution and just unroll it and stick it on. Wait, one more minute. Uh, a lot of people have what they call as a soap rope. Rope they put at the bottom here. It soaks up all the water so it doesn't mess up any electrical or anything. I don't have anything like that. You can run the risk and if you use a little bit of water, you should be fine. But um, I'm gonna put a paper towel down here just in case. I'll put a rope of paper towel basically. Alright, I got it all shrunk and just washing it up and then that's a wrap. It's a tint, I guess, but... I 
I just threw a coin spot on the pass and decided to eat the more heat. Alright, that turned out good. Thanks for watching. Got any other ideas? Any kits? Anything you could think I could have did better on that tint job? I don't know, I haven't done that um, reverse roll a whole lot. If you got any ideas in there, I can do that better. Let me know. Always looking to improve on my work. Alright, thank you. Bye.